and welcome back to the channel everyone today we are back at one of my favorite little creeks in all of virginia to do a little bit of springtime trout fishing but in today's video guys we are here during a big cold front the temperatures have dropped 20 to 30 degrees below average it's absolutely frigid out here and it should have these trout absolutely feeding i love coming out and fishing these springtime cold fronts as i feel like it really does get those trout charged up and ready to feed in today's video guys we're throwing around that fenwick eagle this is a seven foot two piece medium fat got some six pound fluorocarbon line spooled up on that Fluger President, which is a simple little trout magnet jig head hook with one of our Pink Creek bugs and a small split shot to help it get down. So let's not waste any time, guys. Let's hop in the creek here today and let's have some fun. There we go, fish on. Looks like a tiny little rainbow. We will take him though. Very small, little bitty juvenile. Came up and took that old creek bug, no problem. There we go, put top loose. Tiny little guy. We'll let him go right here. Let's put him out of the net, happy and healthy. There we go, guys. All right, guys, just made a quick creek crossing. I'm gonna slide over here to a hole that I've had a lot of success in before. As you can see though, fresh boot tracks there. So this hole's definitely been hit. We're gonna take our time with it, really pick it apart. I walked up along the road over there across the creek and I could see a couple in here. Not a whole lot of activity guys, but these fish do like to hide in here. They're kind of hard to spot. So I've got, there we go. Like I was saying, I've got a lot of faith that we're gonna catch us some and there we go guys. First cast in, fish on. Slide over here. Pop her in that old hellbender net. There we go. First fish out of this run. Second fish of the day. Oh, popped off in the net, guys. Beautiful little rainbow trout. We will take him. So let him go. There we go. Oh, there was a good strong bite right there. Come off from under there and whack that creek bug. Let's try him again. There we go, another fish on right there. That's the same fish that came out for just a moment ago. Got him to come on out and do it again. Looks like another beautiful rainbow trout. Beautiful fish too, pale in colors in comparison to that last one. Wow, absolutely gorgeous. See if we can't grab that old creek bug quickly, pop that loose. Yep, there we go. Wow, beautiful fish number two out of this run. Light in color, got those pink and bronze colors going on. Wow, beautiful. Let him go, happy and healthy. Fish number two out of this run, guys. We haven't even got down in here into the faster current. I assume there'll be some more down in there, so. Heck yeah, guys, we will take it. Check on our creek bug. Looks beautiful, bobbing back in there again. Got him. Oh, jumper. There we go. Oh, quick release right there. That will happen with that barbless hook, guys, but we will take it nonetheless. Heck yeah. Pitch it right in here, slowly bouncing around. Missed him on the first try, got him on the second. Heck yeah, guys. Well, guys and girls, looks like three beautiful little rainbows out of this run, all on that pink creek bug, but we're gonna have to keep it moving, guys. Not really seeing much else. Fish it all the way down there into the faster current. Only three fish to speak of, so let's keep it moving and see what else we can find on this beautiful cold front day. Well, just another huge perk to a bit of a springtime cold front is the fishermen, well, they simply don't come out. This hole right here, if you remember from our last video here, was absolutely crowded with people. 
And today, same conditions. I'm sure there'll be plenty of fish, but there's nobody here but me, guys. And that's exactly what we like to see when we come out here and do a little bit of that cold front springtime fishing out here where nobody else is. We're going to take advantage of that and have this place all to ourselves, at least for a little while. There we go, fish on. Fish number two out of this run. Another beautiful little rainbow. Heck yeah, guys. No super fast action or anything, but still getting a few bites out of here. Go on ahead and grab that old trout magnet jig head hook there. Pop it out. Another beautiful rainbow trout. Wow. Well, I hope they're right here happy and healthy. Can't complain with that, guys. Got the place all to ourselves. Some feeding fish. A little bit cool with a bit of a wind, but that's okay. We will take it, guys. Heck yeah. Got him. Got him down here in this little bit of swift or shallower water. Heck yeah, guys. Fish number three out of this run. We will take it. Go on ahead and flip him up here into the net. Wow, another gorgeous little rainbow. No real size to them, but that's okay. They are super fun to catch nonetheless. There we go, quick pop loose. Another beautiful fish, guys. Simply jigging that old trout magnet hook with that pink creek bug. Heck yeah, let's let him go. Well, guys, just hooked up this absolute giant one. There we go. There we go, got that fish in the net. Realized that I just made a bait change and hadn't turned that camera on, guys. And this big girl right here absolutely crushed that old natural creek bug. Wow, I mean an absolute football, guys. Unfortunately, missed the strike on that one, but it came over and absolutely train wrecked that thing, guys. What a beautiful fish, let's let him go right here. You see it go happy and healthy. Flip over, girl. Flip over and take off. Gosh, these big fish are so hard to get to take back sometimes, guys. Yeah, unfortunately, this was a very long fight with this girl here. She may not want to go back. I'll have to sit here and work her for a minute. Just face her upstream. Give her a few minutes here to collect her bearings. She fought super hard, guys. Take off, big girl. Let's see you go back. Wow, guys, an absolute mondo right there. Crush that old natural creek bug. There she goes right there. Had her bite it twice. We had broken off, went on ahead and retied. Turn that camera off. Guys, I mean, first flip in there after retying, she absolutely hammered it. There she goes right there, back happy and healthy. Heck yeah, guys, that's what we're talking about. Out here, nobody around, getting it done. Heck yes. Got him, there we go. Seen that little guy down there? He had to have it. Just a little bitty guy, but we will take him nonetheless. Well, wow. not sure what number that is for today, but we are absolutely hammering him out here, guys. Super blessed. Have this creek all to ourselves. Dealing with a little bit of wind and cold, but we will take it. Wow. Beautiful fish right there, guys. Just a little bitty guy. It had to have it nonetheless. There it goes. Back in there, happy and healthy. There we go, fish on. Another fish on right there. On that old natural creek bug. Wow, it has been getting it done for us. Heck yeah, guys. Beautiful little fish right there. Grab that old hook, hook pop loose. Wow, 
Another gorgeous little rainbow. We will take him. There we go. Another fish on right there. Another good looking rainbow. Fell victim to that natural creek bug. Wow, it has absolutely got them firing, guys. It went from very slow to quite good. Let's let him go. There we go. Wow, another beautiful one. Got an absolute giant one right here, guys. Got him. Oh, giant one. Absolute giant one, guys. On the creek bug. <laughs> oh, my gosh. This fish is massive. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. No way. Swung and missed this fish. Oh, he popped off right there with our barbless hook. That's okay, guys. Unbelievable. We run those barbless hooks for those reasons to get these fish a chance to go back. Wow, that was probably an eight or nine pounder, guys. Absolutely crushed that creek bug. Heck yes, guys. That's what we like to see. Well, guys, I think that's pretty much going to do it for this run. What an absolute blast, though. It's a couple really nice sized fish out of here, guys. Unfortunately, both of them were epic failures. But hey, that is trout fishing, guys. And oftentimes, the big one, well, that's the one that gets away. So no complaints out of me. I will take it, guys. I just enjoy being out here, enjoying these waters all to myself. Absolutely nobody around. Big fish in the creek, hammering those NRV baits, guys. What more can you ask for?